Hi everyone, I'm Stacy from The Lamer Gamer and today I'm going to show you the new features in the Get to Work expansion pack. So first when you go into your game there is a new town called Magnolia Promenade and I have created a new household in here so I'm going to click on here and show you what it looks like. This is a town, unfortunately there's only four lots, three lots are retail lots and the fourth lot is an empty lot but I have um, chose this house here from the online gallery. So I'm going to go into my game and I'll show you um, the new clothes and hairstyles for girls. And then I'll show you um, the other stuff as well. I'm going to show you the new retail um, category in build mode uh, with my new uh, clothing store that I have created. So this is a new dress. I'm going to show you all the clothes here. Um, get to work. So these are all the full body clothes in the Get to Work expansion. So here's this dress. We have different colors. It's a very nice dress actually. I would wear this dress. Let's change the color of her dress. I like this one. Yes. This is also this is also a new outfit, different colors, very cute. Business savvy woman. See what colors this one comes with. Cute. And this is probably an employee outfit for the retail. I'm definitely not wearing this outfit in my clothing store. In a clothing store, I think you need to be hip. You need to look hip, hey? Let's do, I like this one. Anyways, let's see what else is here. New shirts. This is a cute new shirt. Let's filter these items. Ooh, this one's cute. Ah, no, I didn't mean to do that. Oh, I never saw this one. There's a lot of new clothes in this expansion pack. Wow, I'm quite impressed with how much clothes is in this one. Huh. This is a cute shirt. Wonder if the guys have as many as what the girls have. This is probably looks like a retail employee shirt. This looks like an athletic shirt. Athletic sweater. Okay, let's um, see if we have any new pants. New shorts. Those are cute shorts. I like these shorts. Some new pants. Dress pants. Oh, cute. I like the blue ones. Another s Oh, I thought it was a skirt, but it's actually a pair of shorts. Oh, it matches. Cute. Matches. I like it. I like all the clothes. Oh, is there any shoes? Let's see if there's any new shoes. Okay. Some little toms. Cute little toms. Cute. Not sure if I like these. These look like the ones that, kind of like the ones that came with um, the outdoor retreat. 
Those are cute flats. Very cute flats. Mm, not too fond of those. But nonetheless, very cute. Okay, I think that's all. Let's put my dress back on. Maybe we'll wear this. Hmm. No. This one. We'll see hairstyles. See. We also got new hairstyles with the March patch, the second March patch. So I'll see if I can find those. I like this one. This huh. one's really cute. Very cute. I like that one. Oh, a little bun. I like it. Messy hair. That is nice. This one is very nice. Another bun. I'm going to go back and see which ones. They said they were going to give us some new hairstyles with the merch patch. So far, I do not see them. Is that it? No. Anyways, I don't think Yes, yeah, so I don't think we have them. If we do, I can't find them. Let's see if there's any new bathing suits. Okay, so I'll go into the game now and I will show you the new retail um, category in build mode. And then when I show you the mannequins for the retail, I'll show you uh, some of the kids and male clothing. Okay, so first when you go into your game, if you want to own a retail lot, you have to go into your phone. Click on career slash household and buy a retail store. I have already purchased a retail store and I've already had a couple of days at my business. So I'm going to go to my business location here. Travel. No, you're not doing that. Go. Go to work. this is the one I chose so this is what my clothing store looks like so far I've already had a couple days worth of business I'm not doing too well to be honest what is that food why are people eating my food what I've noticed so far that I don't like is this is the bottom floor of my retail business and this is a top floor which they said we could live up here um, to get all our needs up. But some customers come up here and look around and browse and it's weird. And then your employees come up here and then they all talk to each other and then it's weird because they shouldn't be up here. So really the Sims need to come out with a locked door option. Sims, get on that. So I'm going to go into build mode and I'll show you all the new things so you can buy a cash register I think this is the one I think I have that one maybe yes I have that one there's some um, wall decor lots of wall decor this one kind of looks like a salon like a hair salon but I don't think you can have one of those lots of bakery signs
No. This is a baker's display. So if you want to have a bakery, this is a really good one to have. And this one, these are the shelves that you can have. As you can see, I have lots of shelves around. And you can put anything on them in build mode, in, or buy mode, sorry. And you can click on them in live mode and you can say put this item for sale which I will show you after you also have mannequins I'm going to add a male mannequin just to see what male outfits we have um, this cash register is kinda cool but you have to earn it unlocks from purchasing the register of tomorrow retail perk and I'll show you all the perks how to get perks it's kinda really hard to get perks I'm not doing too well in my business actually so that's the retail items. These are community items. Um, I think these mostly we already have. Already. What's this? <gasps> A new fridge. Cool. I like that fridge. So I guess you can put that in a bakery if you wanted to. I'm not sure if you could sell things from it. I think it's just a fridge. Revenue generating cooler. No, I guess you can. Cool. Front desk. Oh, that's cute. Oh, what front desk do I have? Is there one in here? Ooh, I like this. Okay, these are the all the front desks. With a sleek, smooth finish and flatness that never has seen before, this lab is a scientist's dream for any- Ooh, so this is a scientist item. Cool. Very cool. Most of it looks like bakery items, to be honest. Let's be honest here. Okay. The- Things that I actually found to put on the wall here, you can sell those. It looks like little racks. I actually had to go searching for those because I did see them in the trailer for the retail career, but couldn't find them. It's not in it's not in here. So what I did to find it is I put clothes in my search bar. And these are all the ones that come up. Quite a few. I might actually add some into my store and then there is oh, I can't remember folded clothes I don't remember how to find the other one hotel folded bath towels lucky man folded laundry so there's not actually clothes that you can put on the displays to so which sucks but I I just chose this one which doesn't generate a lot of profit so I might delete them and add something else to my store I also added some boots from the decorations which I've had for sale some little trinkets nail polish and perfumes coffee machine is just for me to drink my coffee um, so I'll go into the mannequins in live mode and show you You can create outfit, change the pose of the mannequin, try an outfit. So these are all, ooh. I didn't know I had all these. So you can dress the mannequin in everyday clothes, formal clothes, athletic clothes, sleep, party, swimwear. You can dress them in all that. What I did notice though is if I have like three female mannequins, I can't dress them in the same outfit but different color which is what I wanted to do initially but I couldn't figure out how to do that yet I think you have to have if you have more than one female mannequin I think you have to have a different um, like one is everyday one has to be formal one has to be athletic I think you have to have a different different one f and same if you have like three males whatever same thing so I already showed you all the female so we'll go into male first select create outfit so we'll create an outfit and create a sim for the males and we'll see what new outfits there are for them 
full body. Let's filter. Good to work. Ooh, that's new. That is cute. I don't think there's going to be as many male outfits as there is female. I would like to add this to my store. Some get to work clothing. Okay, cool. So that's all the full body shirts. Let's see what shirts we have. Oh, lots of shirts. Awesome. Jean jacket. Oh, that's pretty. Nice jacket. Nice formal jacket. It's a nice t-shirt. That was cute. So actually, there's a lot of nice clothes in this expansion pack. I'm, I like it. A lot of nice clothes. Let's see what pants we have. Not as many pants. But nice pants. Cool. For right now, oh, let's see if there's any shoes. Lots of shoes. Some flip flops, some dress shoes, some little toms. I think they're toms. Is that what they're called? Toms? Okay, for now, let's get him to wear this outfit, but not with those shoes. I don't know what shoes. Oh, well, let's keep those for now. I don't think there's any new bathing suits. Okay, let's choose this one. Okay, now I'm going to show you the little girl outfits. So if this is a dress that comes with it. I did forget to show you the jewelry for the female. This looks like a bathing suit. There is a lot of clothes. Wow. I really, really like this expansion pack. Another bathing suit. That's cute. That's not with the expansion pack. This is. Oh, that's cute too. So we'll see if there's any. This is a styled look. I like this one. Let's leave it at this one. There's new shirts. Lots of new shirts. Are we in get to work right here? Oh, just these ones. My bad. And pants. Four pairs of pants. Shoes. I think it's just the little toms for the kid. And these ones. Are all these come with it? Oh, cool. I guess all these shoes come. And let's see hairstyles. Oh, I can't show you hairstyles. Just hats. I don't want to show hats. Well, jewelry. Let's do the jewelry. Go. 
We got some new glasses, some new necklaces, some socks, and leggings. Okay. I'll go into create outfit for uh, the female and then I'll show you all the jewelry that came with the expansion pack as well. There's actually quite a bit of jewelry that came with it. Okay, th yes. So there's an elephant necklace, another necklace here. Let's go up close and try them out. This one. I had this one on I think couple bracelets this one this one I thought there was another one no got some leggings And tights and okay and that's it okay I'm just gonna add a, a little boy mannequin to show you his clothes child male create outfit see styled looks this is a styled look from the expansion pack this one as well, and only two. And I think it's only the overalls. Okay, no shirts. Only two shirts. Pants. Shoes. Basically the same as the girl. Kinda. Accessories. Just glasses. Oh, and there's some necklaces for him as well. And socks. Okay. Okay, so I'm just going to go through a day in the retail career and show you how everything works. First off, I'm just going to delete. I'm going to delete. Uh, maybe I'll keep this one and delete. This, no, I want to delete. Delete that one. Delete that one. Okay, so there's a new tab over here for your retail store. It's cl My store is closed right now. I'm going to open open my store so any hard employees will be arriving momentarily and I did already hire people you have to click on them and assign a task to them when they get to work play so these little signs here and these are not wearing any clothes because I have to restock the item so I'm gonna restock some of these items here because the mannequins, the clothes and the mannequins actually make the most money in the retail store. And right now, I'm not really making too much money. So this is what they look like when they're stocking. It takes actually a long time to stock an item, which is inconvenient. So these are perk points. You earn perk points as you go throughout your day and ring up customers and talk to customers. And you can buy things with them. I bought, for my first, I bought a second employee. So when you open up your retail business, first you're only allowed to have one employee, and then you have to buy additional employees with your perk points. So I already bought another employee, so I have two employees in total. And in order to get a third employee, you have to have additional employee number one. Unlocks the ability to hire one additional employee within, the, I think I already did that one, so I can't do it again maybe. Yes, I already did that one. Employee number two, it's... Oh, I have to have a lot. So... It is a lot of... Okay. So, I might buy something. Register. Two more unlocks. Register. 
faster restocking that would be nice faster checkouts that would be nice it all takes so long to do and by the time you ring in one customer you lose another customer because it's taking you so long to ring in one customer all right so let's just play for a little bit that's my employee he works for me his name is rusty i just actually promoted him because he was unsatisfied with his job that's another of my employee they actually got to work before any customers today. Usually they're really, really late. So before I restock that one, I'm going to <laughs> manage Rusty and I'm going to, how do I sign? Sign work task. <laughs> He's going to ring up customers. So let's leave him at ringing up customers. I quit! What? This place is terrible. I can't stand anymore and I quit. Well, that's terrible. I just promoted him and that's what he wanted. He asked me for a promotion and I gave it to him. These people, they don't appreciate anything. Okay, fine. Just leave then. Just leave. Bye. Fine. I, we don't need you. We don't need you. We <laughs> kind of do need you. <laughs> Outgoing costs. What is this? So the worst thing about starting my day with having all these items that need to be stocked is that I'm going to have a lot of outgoing costs, which is kind of unfortunate. So I'm going to sign her the task of bringing in customers. I think I already did that. Yes. So... Let's not chat with Nancy. Let's restock this item. Because I can make $175 maybe off that. You can also click on the register and there's a lot of things you can do. You can set the store price, but you have to do it when the store is closed. Choose your employee uniforms. Purchase advertising, which I have purchased a long-term television ad. And I have to let it finish, I guess. Let the current ad campaign finish before purchasing a new one. I can do a short-term web, short-term, long-term web. Manage employees, transfer retail funds, which looks like this. No, I'm not going to do it that way. You can do it this way as well, which is faster. So you can transfer funds from your home lot to your retail lot. So in my retail store, I have 9,000. My household, I have 6,000. I'm not going to transfer any right now. I don't need it. So they have these little bars over their head and I think as they browse and you answer their questions, it goes up, but you don't have time to talk to everybody. You just don't. So I'm going to answer her questions. You stock this item. The last couple of days I've been in the red, mostly. So let's see if we can get some people, people buying some stuff today. What is she doing? There's a lot of chatting going on right now. It's kind of overwhelming. What else can I show you guys? What else can we do? So new interaction retail, answer questions, discuss shopping preferences, ask about price range, and as you talk to them more, more uh, options open up. What a choice, what choice, what value I'm ready to buy when you get a chance to ring me up. So when they're ready to be rung up, that appears on top of their head, click on it, ring up customer. And I bet you my employee is not going to do her job. Her assigned task is to bring up customers. She probably won't. 
They never do. Employees are useless. Useless in this game. Useless. Just watch her. She won't do it. She won't do it. She won't ring up that customer. She won't. She just won't. I want to get mad at her for slacking, but apparently she's not slacking. But she's not doing her job, so... Oh, that lady doesn't even work for me and she's taking out my garbage. Thanks. Maybe I should hire you instead of that guy that quit on me. What is your name? What's your name? Nancy. She looks a little mad. Try to calm down. Eh, no, whatever. $262. Mm. She is ringing him up. Look at that. Anybody else need to be rung up? I'm going to try to calm her down. And see if she'll buy something. I think I kind of pissed her off though. Maybe it was me that pissed her off. Where are you going? See, this is... People are going upstairs. A bit. See? See? Weird. She's going to take out my garbage. No? Maybe not. Why is everybody leaving? Why? <laughs> well, let's... Okay, well you're not in my store anymore, so go back in here. Like, I don't get it. Why? Why do you go upstairs? There's no clothes here. And you think my place smells, apparently. Oh, I guess she'd probably clean that. No, don't talk to her. You have to also clean your store. It gets dirty a lot. It's one of the tasks you're going to assign to your employees. I wish they would just do everything. Like, when something needs to be done, I wish they just could do it. She reached her sales skill to level three. Good. My last employee was way better than her. He was at level four, I think. My net profit is one dollar. Negative one dollar, I mean. Negative one dollar. Let's try to make some money. Clean. Clean this place up. Oh, this is a set for sale option. So anything you want to put in your store, you have to set it for sale. Besides the mannequins, they're automatically on sale. Yeah, nobody wants to buy anything from my store today. Let's, let's talk to this guy. This customer is ready to buy, but I don't even see him. He's probably upstairs. Yeah, he's coming around here. Let's see if she'll do her job and ring these people up. Come in. What are you doing? She's not even doing her job. She's just, oh, ooh, 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 she might be doing her job. She might be doing her job. Oh, it's frozen. Good, she actually did her job. I'm impressed. Maybe we'll be in the green today. You can also change your prices, I think I told you that, but it has, the store has to be closed. Mine is at a 50% price market right now. 
Well, that's actually more than what I thought it was going to be. Good, let's restock this item. I'll probably in the red again if when I restock these items. I'm going to end the day pretty soon. Let's ring her up. See if she'll ring her up. Come on. Come on, do your job. Go, go, go. 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 Mm. Do your job. Let's bring her up, because clearly she's not doing it. <laughs> this guy's been in here for quite a while, just staring at those shirts. <laughs> the store gets pretty busy, it's just not a lot of people buying things. Maybe just they take a long time to decide what they want. I wonder what Toga for sale tag means. Oh no! I don't want to do that! I don't want to do that! No, maybe I will do that. Let's see how that plays out. See if more people will buy things because I got it on sale. Let's restock. Restock. Oh, he's ready. Come on, Missy, do your job. No, you don't want to chat with her. Go away. Come on, people, buy things. Buy things from my store. <laughs> oh, she is ringing him up. Good. Good, you're doing your job, lady. Oh, I made some money. Come on. Did you do him? Yes. Okay, so I'm going to close my store and I'm going to end the video here. So six items were sold for $1,500. Wages for s Alice. <laughs> I guess I didn't have to pay the other guy because he <laughs> quit when he got there. $192 for eight hours. Was my store even open eight hours? That oh, doesn't seem right. Okay. Anyways, I'm going to leave my video there and I'm going to continue on with the series for my retail store as well I'm going to start a series for the doctor career and the detective career and the scientist career. So I want you guys to check out those when I add them as well. If you like the video, please subscribe. Thank you for watching. Bye.